But do you know where I might find some moonshine? What? Moonshine. You no, know, strong liquor. Over strong. Wow, you want to get over drunk? <laughs> no, no, it's not for drinking. <laughs> what is it for? Oh, I just need some. Well, as luck would have it, you are in the legal hooch capital of America. Yeah. There's plenty of real booze here. Yeah. But for shine, well, I'm guessing you'd need to go out into the woods. I mean, I know you'd have to go out into the woods. Well, listen. I don't need that much. How much? About a hundred gallons. Oh, shine? Yes, thereabouts. Why? Oh, all right, I'm trying. I'm building a machine. A machine of love. <laughs> hundred gallons of hooch and love's gonna come pretty cheap. Please, friend. I'll pay. Just, just, just bring it here. It's for a good cause. Well, if anyone knows who's moving that kind of shine, It'll be that stagecoach guy. Come on, pal. I need a doctor. All right, friend, no. all right. You're gonna be okay. You're gonna help me? Uh, you gotta. Uh, uh, you gotta. Um, um, please. Please. I'll get you Do help. Something. Just stay alive. Uh, okay. Okay.
We're nearly there. Just hold on a little longer, all right? Must stay awake. Well, I never. What is wrong with you? I've never seen anything like that before. Extraordinary. I've been witness to strange son of a Dios. Where? Where am I? You give up now. I didn't think I'd see something like that today. It's graceful. I'm dying. This is it. Orale, muévete. Enough to Baby. make you lose sleep. What's the problem? Sit him down in this chair. What happened? Just saw you fall out of the saddle. Don't worry, you're at the doctor. Thanks, friend. I appreciate it. Sure. There's also the matter of my payment. But we'll deal with that later. All right. All right. A lot of blood loss. And this wound's badly infected. I'll save as much as I can, but I'll have to amputate. What? What did you Just say? Try to breathe. Uh, I'll give you something for the pain. No. Uh, there you are. Then I'll knock him out for a while. You did a good thing bringing him here. But now, I'd recommend moving along. <clears throat> you do not want to see this. Sorry it's come to this.
hearts and screams from the basement of the gunsmith. I can't even imagine what Excuse me, pardon. How do you do, sir? Glad you dropped in. I've got that, uh, information you asked for. Um, I need something more specific this time. A wagon full of moonshine. Well, you might just be in luck. I knew I picked the right feather to speak to. You're leaving me, huh? So. Yeah, we'll leave this there. <laughs> what you fools up to? It's Mr. Black's fault. His fault, the darky white. Although I don't know why they call him that. Look at him. Don't you start now. I'll knock the color clean off of you. Come All on. Right. And I'll right. tell you, on. you lily livered. Enough. Huh. You two fools look like you've just run off a chain gang. Yeah, what of it? What are you doing? Starving. They got bounty posters for us all over town. And we can't go into town to get supplies. Say, mister, maybe you can do us fools a favor. We ain't bad guys at all. He's OK. You and for a darkie. Shut it, you pasty face streak of piss. Yeah, I had up to here with you. Enough. Do your goddamn favor what you want. Maybe you can go into town and take down them wanted posters of us. <sighs> okay. Maybe meet us back at the campfire in the woods and tell us how you did. Uh, maybe bring us a little bite to eat? Don't push your luck. Nice fella. Yeah, you love nice fellas. Don't you start up again. Just shut up. You shut up!
ain't as bad as you made out there. Bad? They worse than worse. You always was one for gossip. Jethro Minglethorpe. Gossip, gossip, gossip. But as usual, you're spreading lies. Lies? Every fool knows the charges were trumped up. But the darky killed a white man. Jimmy Holdacre had a weak heart. He died of a heart attack. Nonsense. And Samson Black was set up. Everyone knows Judge Amory took a bribe. You don't believe that, do you? Sure. And you call me a gossip? Could be better. Well, anyway. How's your Tom? He's fine. Just fine. Marlene? Still with us. Have a fine day. seen an Englishman. Really funny here. <laughs> Good evening to you. Have you seen Gavin? You still haven't found him? Nope. But I won't give up. He's lost. One morning, I just woke up and he wasn't there. Someone must have taken him. <sighs> Maybe he just left. Gavin? No. No. We were best mates. I mean, really, best mates. He'd never leave me. Never. Gavin! Oh, I am so worried. Gav! Gav! Uh, Gav! Where are you? Where are you? I need that poster. There's been a recall. I weren't born yesterday. This one's mine, so you can go and get your own. I told you, fella. This poster's mine. Don't make me tell you again. I am so worried. I'm working, mister, and I can't work when I'm watched. Get out of here. You taking liberties, boy?
Hey, yo. This is a damn snake. Howdy, friend. That kind of yeah. talk will land you in hell. You don't pretend to keep talking like this. In you need of a good story? No pleasant, neither. Don't mock me. I have been through something. Be seeing you around. Rose. Hey, I need to get to that poster behind you. Would you move a little? <laughs> I will not. Deputy put up plenty. Go get one of those. Hey, move. I need that poster. Oh, I'll move, all right. How's this for moving? This what you wanted? Ah! You're as good as Barry, <gasps> cocksucker! Almost uh, hurt. Uh, no. No. Feel free to run away. Bounty hunting. Bastard.
Bad men. Sure. Real unpleasant. Oh, oh, Wendell. On Kai. Hello again, I've been sir. Waiting on that That's just the way of things, I guess. Out of the damn way. You brought hell down on yourself. Mr. First time here, I think. Don't miss the tobacco just behind the door there. Thank you, really. Welcome. Your first time in my shop? Terrible thing what happened to the parlor house. No surprise the Braithwaite's were behind it.
Fine morning. Hello. How you been keeping? Oh, I can't keep it. What's the matter with you, huh? I was in town. Pretty hot. There's quite a price on you boys. It is so unfair. I, I didn't do nothing. Well, they said you was wanted for murder. It wasn't murder. It was self-defense. And you killed a farmer? Well, firstly, I would have, but he died before I could. And secondly, well, he had it coming. He... I don't like to say. Well... Ain't no business of mine. Here's the posters. Thanks, partner. That's that, then. That's that. Free at last. Free from you. At least. Well, not quite. No? We should wait a while first, see if anyone's on our trail. You're right. Too risky to split up now. Two sets of eyes is better than one. This ain't permanent, though. It's a temporary measure. Well, right, right, till things blow over. Then I'm done with you, Black. I'm counting the hours, White. You've done enough for us. We're on our own now. You helped us enough, okay? 